You can even throw stuff like you could in the first game, this is beautiful. Hi guys and welcome to my latest video and welcome to Amnesia Rebirth. Those of you who have been following the channel recently will know that uh, last week, Saturday and Sunday, I played both Dark Descent and A Machine for Pigs all in one go in one live stream, or well, in two live streams, but you know what I mean. Um, and of course I've played the entire games on the channel and all that's available. Uh, but I haven't played this yet, so I thought I should get to it, considering that the fourth game has already been released and I haven't even played the third game, so I need to get on with it, really, don't I? I know, based on reviews, that this is much closer to The Dark Descent than A Machine for Pigs. I do prefer A Machine for Pigs, but nevertheless, I'm sure I'm going to enjoy this very much. Uh, if the reviews are anything to go by, because apparently it's quite good. Uh, and I see no reason to continue dally-dallying, so let's get on with it. Um, original game mode, that would make sense. You like horror and you're up for a challenging story-driven experience. Darkness and monsters increase your fear cause and long-term repercussions. This is the game experience as originally intended. Well, let us get on with it. I like this loading screen. This game should not be played to win. <laughs> well, immerse yourself in the world and the story. Fear and darkness are your enemies. Yeah. I saw that loading screen when I first opened up the game and it's pretty cool. Pretty cool loading screen. And there's sort of this lightning tree thing. Whatever this is. So I wonder when this is set. Are we finally in the 20th century? Or? I suppose we'll find out I should stop asking questions because they're probably all going to be answered very soon. We'll find out. There is a moment when you realize what the pain has made of you. In hiding, curled in on yourself, unable to show the world your face. Okay. It's there. Sorry about lashing out, even at those closest to you. Time has passed, and time is a thief. It has stolen your memories. The agony has faded, but so has every precious moment of joy. You have been hollowed out from the inside. And there's nothing left of the person you used to be. Uh, sorry. But you try. You try to remember how to smile. You try to remember how to love. And one day you crawl out from your hiding place and step back into the world. And then, every day, you do what you must to survive. The 1930s, I suppose. Pretending it's not there won't make it go away. Salim, it's just turbulence. It'll settle down soon. Yes, yes, I know. It's hard, though. You know, your head tells you one thing, but your heart disagrees. Try to sleep. I couldn't. I keep imagining what might go wrong. I know someone who can help you. Uh, who's that? Marka. Oh. No idea you brought him. I didn't want him to be lonely. I know my heart. It's good for him to have an adventure. 
be glad when this journey's over, I think. He's had a hard life. And there's so much more to come. Alex? Yeah, oh. <gasps> Yasmin, get up here! Hello. Hello. Oh dear, what is that all about? That's the second horror game I've started this year that's started with a plane crash or an aircraft. Don't forget, don't lose it. No, no, come on. Need to find him. He must understand. Outlast 2 is your own. It's all because of her! Focus! I am Tessie. I am still Tessie. What? Where? Rodden, Rodden. I have Rodden. It will help, but you must try to keep calm, or it will get worse. Do not allow yourself anger. Do not allow yourself to fear. You understand me, Tassi? Lord and Rodden, drink the Lord and Rodden. It is vital for your survival that you drink the Lord and Rodden. I don't know, I'm going to put my bets on him being dead. I'm not trying to sound cruel or anything. I have to remember she will die if I sell him. Yeah, I can read, thank you. Memories. We have that. I, I have Lord. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. But you must. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see, so these are kind of hazy memories. I see. My book, my handwriting. Oh, yeah. I don't remember. Mrs. Ritter, Mr. Hanetti. Doctor. Hello? That's, are you here? That's the doctor. I'm here. I'm here. Hello? Hello? This is Tazzy? I'm trying my best, man. Eva. 
Yeah, 1937, all right. Algeria. All right. All right, then. Um. The door's broken. There was a handle, I think, before. Might it be that? Oh, yeah. Whew. This must be the first time in any amnesia game that you actually s go outside during the day. Or you go outside at all, really. Help! For God's sake, help me! I remember... People were... hurt. In the crash, I was here. You think? Where did they go? Where's Salim? Okay, you can't rotate them like you could into the game. It's all right, my friend. We'll get you out. Oh, it's T. Fairly bizarre choice, but all right. Rotate does not begin with T. Leon, Jonathan, give us a hand here. In my case, left side, bandages, quickly. This is interesting. This is very interesting indeed. Christ and his little angels. We are fought here. That's not a word people used in 1937, is it? Out here. Staying in direct sunlight is a bad idea, keeps the shade. Well, yeah, there ain't no bloody shade, is there? Wait, thank you. Well, we've no choice. We need to get them to shelter. I know. It's Salim. He's hurt. You know what he's like. Let's get him down there, then you and I can sit on him while the doc takes a look. Don't worry. The caves aren't far. The caves aren't far. Caves. Caves. <sighs> I can't even rotate that one. Would you believe it? Unrotatable. Caves. Press and hold shift while moving to run. Cat tongues. Beautiful. Salim! Salim, are you there? Somehow, I'm gonna 
guess that the answer to your question is new. Ah. Yes. This is how rocks look, I believe. Yes. Um, I remember all the times I've gone climbing a mountain, I've seen these perfectly straight lines. Um, and this game is from 2020. Disgusting graphics. That's a joke. These are actually very good graphics. I honestly don't think video game graphics can get much better than this. Like I said, they haven't really improved that much. I mean, this doesn't look that much better than the first game. That's not insulting this, that's complimenting the first game on how good it looked. I mean, it's not photorealistic, obviously, but I honestly don't believe it's possible for a game to be photorealistic. Also, this staying out of the sunlight thing is a quite interesting reversal of the mechanics from the first game, because for the first game you want to stay in the light and out of the darkness, and this you want to stay out of the light. Or at least out of the sun. I know it's probably not going to stay like this for the whole game, but it literally just said earlier that you need to stay out of the darkness. But it's good, isn't it? People have been here. So, we'll be shot with salt instead of dying of thirst. I get the heat. Leon. What? No point getting your hopes up. We're in this shit. Yeah? You're not too wrong there, mate. This looks really good. There is a cave. Oh, thank God. You can even throw stuff like you could in the first game. This is beautiful. Dearest Susan. Dearest Alfie. The stories don't do this place justice. It is amazing. You've never seen anywhere as busy as the market in Algiers. The smells, the flavours, the colours, and oh, the noise. I may have picked you both up a little something. You never know your luck. All my love, always. Dad. Beautiful. I'm starting my journal. I'm going to get used to... It's going to take me a while to get used to T being rotated. I've always... Why do some of them have, um, you know, narration and some of them don't? The first came about that and it always confused me a little bit. Those lectures in London, and uh, Charlie back at the Institute recommended her. Got a good head on her. I like her. No, don't you give me that look. That is all for this time, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next thing that I do. Goodbye.